that we know how the video player works, let's look at how we copy all of the lesson files over to our own personal computer so that we can conveniently access them from within SolidWorks. To do so, simply select the Lesson Files button above this Getting Started video. I will note, each lesson has a Lessons Files button that's going to link to just the files for that particular lesson. But again, the Lesson Files button for the Getting Started video contains all of the lesson files. So let's just go ahead and click that Lesson Files button. By selecting the Lesson Files button, we'll see that we've launched a Windows Explorer window. We now simply need to copy all these files to our local drive or network drive. To do so, I'll simply select all the files, select Edit, and select Copy. In my case, I've already created a folder on my desktop, but you may want to create a folder in another location. I'll simply open the folder where I'd like to paste the files, select Edit, and select Paste. You may have noticed we could have used Control-C for Copy and Control-V for Paste. Now that I have all the files in my own personal location, I can begin setting up SolidWorks.